Today, we delve into the gripping story of Tamar, a tale woven with elements of tragedy, lust, and revenge. Join me as we explore this poignant biblical narrative and seek to understand its layers of complexity. Our story unfolds in the pages of the Old Testament within the book of Genesis. Tamar, a central character, is introduced as the daughter-in-law of Judah, a son of the patriarch Jacob. The stage is set in a patriarchal society where lineage, honor, and justice hold significant weight. Tamar's story takes a tragic turn when she is married to Judah's firstborn son, Er. However, Er's actions displease the Lord, leading to his untimely death. In adherence to ancient custom, Tamar is then married to Er's brother, Onan, in an attempt to fulfill the duty of providing an heir. The narrative takes a darker twist as Onan, driven by selfish motives, refuses to fulfill his obligation to provide offspring for his deceased brother. His sin, described as spilling his seed, results in divine retribution and his own demise, leaving Tamar widowed once again. With the loss of two husbands and no heir, Tamar finds herself in a precarious situation. In this patriarchal society, the duty to provide an heir falls on the shoulders of the next male in line, Judah's youngest son, Shelah. However, Judah hesitates, fearing that Shelah might also meet an untimely fate. Tamar decides to take matters into her own hands. Faced with the prospect of being forgotten and marginalized, she devises a plan to secure her future and ensure the continuation of her deceased husband's line. She disguises herself, veils her identity, and positions herself along Sheila's path. In a twist of events, Judah, mistaking her for a prostitute, engages in relations with Tamar. Tamar's actions, though unconventional, highlight her resourcefulness and determination to overcome the challenges posed by societal norms and her own circumstances. Tamar's widowhood is a poignant chapter in biblical narrative, shedding light on the societal expectations, challenges faced by women in a patriarchal structure, and the complex dynamics surrounding issues of inheritance and progeny. Tamar's actions come to light when she presents Juba with proof of his indiscretions, personal effects he left with her during their encounter. Judah, recognizing his own shortcomings, acknowledges Tamar's righteousness and the role he played in the unfolding tragedy. As we continue to explore these ancient stories, it becomes clear that they offer not only moral lessons, but also insights into the intricate tapestry of human relationships, societal norms, and the quest for survival and continuity. The story of Tamar is a poignant chapter in biblical history, marked by tragedy, deception, and the quest for justice. It challenges societal norms, explores the consequences of sin, and ultimately highlights the theme of redemption. If you found this exploration intriguing, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more biblical insights, and ring that notification bell to stay connected. Until next time, may these ancient tales continue to unfold their wisdom and complexity.